This is Steve Down, and today I'm at the Broadmoor, a five-star luxury hotel in Colorado Springs, Colorado. Built in 1918 as the Grand Dame of the Rockies, it was the finest resort destination along the Rocky Mountains during the age of railroads, attracting a wealthy 20th century clientele drawn to the beauty and splendor of Pikes Peak. This historic hotel was built after Spencer Penrose had seen Europe's finest hotels and decided to build a lodge with no expense spared. Today's wealth wake-up call is, education is not required. Neither Microsoft's Bill Gates nor Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg finished their freshman, uh, freshman year at Harvard. Apple's Steve Jobs had no college degree. Richard Branson ended his academic career at age 16, yet he owns Virgin Air and hundreds of other Virgin companies. Spencer Penrose graduated last in his class from Harvard in 1886, yet the Broadmoor Hotel was the least of his accomplishments. Penrose started as a ladies' man, an adventurer who became a successful entrepreneur in the gold fields of nearby Cripple Creek in the 1890s and by the founding of Kennecott Copper Mine, the largest open pit copper mine in the world located in Utah. But that was just a start as he founded sugar companies, utilities, highways, railroads, real estate companies, banks, dams, refineries, mining companies, paper companies, hotels, and the list goes on and on. Add to this list his phil uh, philanthropy, including museums, arenas, hospitals, the Red Cross, and other foundations. Again, never forget that he graduated last in his class. It has been said, school is a place where former A students teach mostly B students to work for C students. In other words, the C students run the world. If you have little or no education, then you have no excuse because education is not a requirement. Go to stevedown.com and discover the company started by this C student. Now go out there and create wealth.